Hello everyone, this is Dr. Nikita here. Let's learn the mnemonic to remember the contents of superior orbital fissure within and outside the common tendinous ring. So the question is the cranial nerve which passes through superior orbital fissure but outside the common tendinous ring is which of the following. So let us have a look at the superior orbital fissure. So this is the superior orbital fissure. You have a part which is within the common tendinous ring, part above it and part below it. So within the common tendinous ring, we can see the superior and inferior division of third that is oculomotor and the abducent nerve and we have the nasoferiary nerve. What is outside above the common tendinous ring is lacrimal frontal nerve which are branches of ophthalmic, the first branch of uh, trigeminal and the trochlear nerve. So basically it is LFT, lacrimal frontal and trochlear which are outside. Remember left outside is LFT that is left outside LFT is lacrimal frontal and trochlear. So the cranial nerve fourth trochlear is the fourth and lacrimal and frontal branches of the ophthalmic division of trigeminal nerve they are outside. Which branch of ophthalmic nerve is within the common tendinous ring that is nasociliary. So remember nasociliary is in. So in the common tendinous ring part of superior orbital fissure is nasociliary, the third and the sixth nerve. So it is the fourth cranial nerve which is outside the common tendinous ring. So the homework for you, let me know in the comments what are these foramens, these structures in the skull, the A and B. What is this structure and what is this structure? We have discussed this in one of the NF100 episodes on YouTube. If you want to know the tricks of the foramen of skull and the contents passing, do watch that video as well. It's available on the same channel. Thank you so much. I'm hoping to see you all in the free life class on an academy app daily at 5 p.m. Use code Dr. Nikita Live to join the classes. Thank you so much.